An elderly man named Tom found lost and injured in a heavily wooded part of Sterling Heights. Tonight we see firsthand how police rescued him using a mix of high tech and low tech tracking. Good to have you with us for Local 4 News at 6. I'm Devin Skillian. I'm Kimberly Gill. If you have a loved one with dementia, you know how dangerous it can be if they go missing. Tom Stone wandered away from his home southeast of 15 and Van Dyke. The search to find him led police to a wooded area about a half mile west of Van Dyke. Priya Mann joins us live. And Priya, that search included a drone, a tracking device, but perhaps most importantly, an AK-9. That's right, Kim, Devin. K-9 Chip is really the star of the show here. Once he found Tom, he stayed by Tom's side. But you also mentioned a tracker. It's a watch that Tom wears that he can't take off. Well, it was running out of power. And when you see the body cam video of just how thick the vegetation was, well, we could have been reporting a very different story today. We've been together a long time. 55 years. Tom and Dolores Stone's love story could have ended tragically this week. Tom has Alzheimer's and walked out the front door early Wednesday morning and disappeared. So I just grabbed my car keys, pajamas and all, and got in the car. Dolores called police while monitoring the tracker Tom wears as a watch. But time was running out. The tracker was losing juice. All she knew was that Tom was in a wooded area near 15 Mile and Van Dyke. The tracker only had 10 minutes on it and it expired. But if it hadn't been the tracker, none of us would have looked back there. Sterling Heights police deployed a drone and a canine unit to search the thick, heavy brush. You all right, man? No. Okay. We're going to get you out of here, okay? Good boy. Good boy, Jeff. The canine Chip was a very good boy and found Tom with only a few minor cuts. Charlie, we got him. What was it like when police told you we got him? I took the biggest sigh. Biggest sigh. It was like relief. I like your walking stick. So by the time he got home, he doesn't remember it. All you can say is he knew he met a nice dog. The police dog kept coming to him and rubbing against him, trying to get him to follow him. It's all he remembers. He met a nice dog. You know, the other thing that Tom remembers is how to be a ladies' man. Quite a way with words, that Thomas. Uh, Dolores says uh, she is so thankful, of course, to Sterling Heights Police. And she's also urging anyone who has a loved one with dementia to get one of those trackers. She says without that, they wouldn't have thought to look in that wooded area. But as you saw from that body cam footage, police were really up against it. Uh, it took about 90 minutes in total to find Tom. Only a few minor injuries. Again, it could have been a lot worse, uh, especially if they weren't able to get to him as quickly as they did. Reporting live, I'm Priya Mann. Still a really scary 90 minutes, I'm sure, and so glad that he was found safe. Priya, we appreciate it.